Hey everyone, welcome back to Andy Demos, and today I'm excited to show you a wide range of sounds coming out of this new analog amp emulator from Thorpey FX. It's the Scarlet Tunic. The Scarlet Tunic is Thorpey's take on what many consider the Sid Barrett amp, the Selmer Treble and Bass 50. In fact, the project all started when Lee Harris, who plays a Nick Mason's saucer full of secrets, needed a pedal to handle those pre-dark side tones. Just like a real tube amp, Thorpey's Scarlet Tunic uses a transformer for amp-like sag and power amp saturation, while the internal voltage doubling provides huge headroom to take on any pedals that need a little interstellar overdrive. This analog amp emulator eases into Vox Chime and high watt headroom thanks to the three selectable gain levels in the sensitivity switch. Then select your master character by choosing from the three-way deep and bright toggles and fine tune it all with the bass and treble controls. Last but not least, the powerful presence control enhances upper mids and helps the tunic ease into other classic British amp tones. Check out the Scarlet Tunic and other superior fidelity tone machines from England at ThorpeyFX.com. Let's start by going over the basic controls because it doesn't really behave like your average overdrive and that's because it isn't. It's actually like a preamp and these three toggle switches in the center really determine what kind of character. So let's just start with them in the center which is going to give the highest headroom the least amount of gain and just a little bit of that British flavor to the deluxe reverb I'm playing into today. <laughs> really on the uh, virtual low input of this amplifier. So I'm gonna back off the gain a little bit and then go to the next step with that sensitivity control. <laughs> And it's a really chimey sound immediately, so let's just beef up the low end and back off on the presence, which is the upper mids, and it's really where all that jangle resides. <laughs> Now we're going to keep going as far as gain and just edge with the bright switch and that last higher gain setting on the sensitivity, so watch out. <laughs> So as you can imagine, you could get really compressed and really accentuate that sag and sizzle from the uh, internal transformer. Let's try some different settings. I'm gonna crank up the presence this time and back off on the treble, and we'll tighten things up with that deep switch.
I know that SID sound is really all about that single coil in the bridge position, but let's uh, take advantage of all this, you know, treble and high headroom we have and really get a detailed sound with humbuckers. On the right, we have the gain in its highest setting, but I've backed off on the gain knob about 75%. Then the bright switch is in the up position, and that's kind of a nice middle ground. Meanwhile, the deep on the left is in the middle, and that's the least amount of bass, but I've cranked up the fine-tuned bass adjustment just right where it wants to thicken up without getting fuzzy. headroom available it's just a perfect fit for any kind of boost or overdrive you want to put before it and I have the Radio Shop HSS Evolution set and if you know about these handmade pickups also from England uh, these uh, single coils are actually more of a humbucker output so they're a little bit overwound they use Alnico 5 magnets and I think it's gonna be a great test because we have these kind of darker pickups that are in more in line with the humbucker so it's a really even sound from one to the next uh, but we have kind of a smoother sound overall. So I'm going to use that tunic to really just brighten up the whole thing. And the Dane is actually a very smooth overdrive too. So we're really just kind of kind of lift the blanket on the tone by putting this scarlet tunic at the end. Well, that's the Scarlet Tunic, a pedal that really just feels and behaves more like an amplifier than a typical overdrive. And as you just heard, it can lend that classic UK chime to any effect. And you can find out more at ThorpeEffects.com. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you for another Andy demo.